Ooh, what's up, Internet? Corey Zamier here, thrifting in Connecticut. Technically, collecting with Alicia. I wasn't the one that picked these up. She had some time, what was it, after work? Yeah. Went to local thrift store. They're honestly as picked through enough as it is. I don't need to mention their name. Those in Connecticut will know who the fuck they are. Got three games for me. Unfortunately, one of them, they kind of did a little shady, shady business on. I don't know. Uh, for two dollars, we got Samurai Warriors for the PlayStation Complete. For ninety-five cents. Now I know this game on the GameCube is kind of expensive, or at least one of the Time Splitters game is is pretty expensive. I'm not sure which one. I know this was very popular back in the day. I never really played it back then, so I don't really have any nostalgia for it, but 95 cents. And this last game is a no-brainer all day. Unfortunately, they had this priced at $4, and when she brought it up, the way this place works, they have the games out on like a CD, DVD shelf thing but the discs aren't in there uh, when she went to go pay for this they said oh that's not four dollars that's supposed to be eight dollars and they wouldn't budge picked it up I'm pretty sure it's still worth like 15 to 20 I, I'm kind of hazy on that just because I've had so many of them but I've sold them at like garage sales I believe I think the last one I had I sold at a garage sale and gave someone a really good deal I don't know but disc only with the case eight dollars pretty steep but what are you gonna do especially at this place standing in their line is a fucking test of patience to begin with that at that point you pretty much have to go through with it anyways Hot. Ha! You're in the video. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. You're in the TV. You're in the TV. Caught. You have guest starred in this pickup video. All right, guys. Like the video. Subscribe if you're new. And as always, keep it real, internet. I love you guys.